What you're looking at here is the online textbook for Mobile Computer Science Principles, which is going to be an AP course next year. And this course was built by Trinity College using Google Course Builder. And the language of instruction for this course is App Inventor 2. What we want to do is provide an auxiliary set of materials for advanced students taking this course who may not want to use AI2 as the programming language, but instead may want to use Android Studio as the language of instruction. So our strategy here is to take this uh, textbook and supplement it with another uh, offering using Google Course Builder so that the students will be, will be able to sit in the same course alongside the traditional CSP students, but each time they get to a project, instead of doing the project on App Inventor 2, they're going to do the corresponding project on uh, Android Studio. So what do you need to do to get ready for the summer internship? You need to do two things. First, you need to download Android Studio at home, and you need to watch some videos on uh, Android Studio. Now, if I go over to YouTube right now and uh, type in uh, Android uh, Studio Tutorials, Tutorials for Beginners, like right there, uh, there, you can see that there's tons of them here. Now, the two that I really like, one is from Programming Knowledge, that's this one, consisting of 52 videos, and the other was from New Boston, consisting of 77 videos. Now, you don't have to watch anywhere near the end of these all these videos. If you just watch the first dozen or so, uh, you'll become extremely familiar with it. The other thing that you need to do to prepare for the internship is to become intimately familiar with Google Course Builder. Just as I mentioned, this course was built with Course Builder. You want to become familiar with Course Builder because the supplementary materials we're going to provide the student are going to live on Google Course Builder. So uh, it's a free tool. So at home, you should download Google Course Builder. And the best way to uh, get familiar with it is to go ahead and build a small course on your own. Now, this course doesn't have to be a computer science course or even a technology course. Find some area of expertise that you have, whether it's photography or maybe taking care of hamsters or whatever it is, and just build a small course on that and then have a friend of yours take the course. Make sure they put a few videos in there, maybe a test, a quiz, uh, some other study materials, and that will be, get you nice and familiar with Google Course Builder before a, your summer internship. 